Hello everyone, welcome to my class, math lesson with Miss Kenny. Our first lesson in this semester is about simultaneous linear equations. Linear equations, also known as straight line graphs, you have learned about linear equations previously. And today you are going to learn about simultaneous. Simultaneous means at the same time. So you are going to draw straight line graphs at the same time. Solving simultaneous linear equations can be done in uh, three methods. Elimination method, substitution method, and graphical method. And today you are going to use the graphical method, but you are not going to draw the graph manually using graph paper, but you are going to use the uh, graphing software called a GeoGebra. Okay, simple pair of simultaneous linear equations. We are going to draw two graphs or a pair of graphs. Okay, why? Because to solve linear equations with uh, two variables, x variable and y variables, you only need two graphs. Okay, let's see the example taken from the real life problem. Three oranges and two apples cost uh, $2.36. Five oranges and two apples cost $3. Find the cost of each item. First, you need to formulate the linear equation based on uh, the information given. So, let oranges or an orange be x and an apple be y. So, 3x uh, plus 2y equals 2 point. 3, 6. Next, 5x plus 2y equals 3. After you get two linear equations, open your browser and find the geogebra.org here. After you find it, click this button, start calculator, click. You will get this appearance. And now you start to input the lin linear equation, the first one, 3 x three oranges plus and two apples cost two dollar thirty six cents three x plus two y equals two point three six after you finish typing press the enter the geogebra will automatically label the equation as eq1 eq1 means uh, equation one and then the graph the straight line graph will be labeled as EQ1. And then type the second equation. 5 oranges and 2 apples cost $3. So 5x plus 2y equals 3 and then press enter. The GeoGebra will automatically generate the label EQ2. And then the straight line graph will be labeled as EQ2. So you know which one it is. So next click the point of intersection then the, the GeoGebra will show you the coordinates of the point of intersection like this intersect this is the x coordinate 0 0.32 is the x coordinate 0 0.7 is the y coordinate okay since x is the price of an orange and y is the price of an apple so the price of one orange is 32 cents and the price of one apple is 70 cents. Let's put this in answer statement. I'm using this three dot symbol that looks like a triangle. This means uh, therefore, therefore cost of one orange is 32 cents. Cost of one apple is 70 cents. This is how we solve uh, simultaneous linear equations using graphical method. There are three possible solutions here. This is the first one that uh, we have just learned. That there is one point of intersection. The graphs uh, intersect at one point. It means one solution. But sometimes, 
the graphs are parallel lines like this one. So there will be no point, no points of intersection, no points of intersection. So it means no solution for these simultaneous linear equations. Then the third one, uh, the graphs, the graphs coincide means one is on top of the other. In this case, there will be infinite number of solutions, means every point on the line, every point on the line is the solution. So there will be infinite number of solutions. This is the example, x minus y equals 1 and 3x minus 3y equals 3. You see, the second equation, if you simplify the second equation, there will be two identical linear equations here. Okay, If you divide all terms by 3, you get x minus y equals 1. Okay, So they are identical. It means they coincide. Which means the graphs is on top of the other. Okay. For question and assignment, I'm going to use Zoom meeting. So please check your Google Classroom. Thank you for watching Math Lesson with Miss Kenny.